And the vice presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party and Delta State Governor Ifan Yokoa says the PDP candidate Atiku Abubakar will devolve more powers to local governments to ensure more dividends of democracy if he's elected. Governor Okowa, who was represented by the Commissioner for Information, spoke during an inspection of projects completed by the Shimbali South Council Chairman. He commended him for supplementing, or rather complementing, the state government's urban renewal drive and urged other council chairmen to emulate him. The council chairman on the spot promised to continue to collaborate with the state government in order to bring development to the grassroots. Chiku Abubakar and Okowa, as part of their five points, agenda is the issue of devolving powers to the local government and align the local government and the state to be able to also perform. What you have done today is a clear demonstration of the value that local government can bring to the table when they are empowered. Here in Delta, like you have also rightly mentioned, Senator Kowa has made it a point of duty that local government allocation gets to them the way it comes from Abuja in addition to augmenting it from the state internally generated revenue. And so for me, I see what is happening here today as an opportunity to pay review so that the other 24 local government areas can also look inwards and see to what extent have they been able to keep that directive of the governor on the, 20, on the 8th of March 2021 when you were sworn in. We've um, constructed of which we are, we are all witnesses an ultra-modern legislative complex with state-of-the-art facilities. That's where we are just coming from. We've also renovated and redesigned and refurnished the executive complex with uh, sophisticated furnishing and appliances. We've been able to install closed circuit CV within the executive complex with plans to extend to the entire secretary that's time gone by but I shortly reiterate that the developmental plan of this administration will definitely cut across the entire Oshimani South local government area and also